This is one we found on Park for Night. It's just in Belper, uh, Derbyshire, not far from Derby itself. It's a free car park. It's a car park for the mill and the Thai restaurant. There's the mill. I think now it's a museum. And just over there is the restaurant. It's quite loud at night but it's uh, strangely hypnotic. It doesn't keep you awake. Well, it didn't keep me awake anyway. And that might have been down to a few glasses of famous grouse, whichever it was. Well, I didn't see this last night, but it is on park for night, so up to you guys. Take the chance if you want to. We didn't get bothered and we've not got clamped. <laughs> Bit chilly. Yeah. <laughs> Bit of a fresh one this morning. They call it bracing. <laughs> I don't think I'll be wearing my shorts. <laughs> Didn't plan that very well, did you? Oh, no, okay.
Ella's not packed in warm, in warm clothes for this cool weekend. So that's, you know what that's going to mean. We've got summer stuff. <laughs> <laughs> so where are we going? Going to get some jumpers. Where from? <laughs> <laughs> Charity shops. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> right, let's go. Okay. Today we're in the market town of Ashbourne which is in Dovedale and we're on the hunt for some charity shops. I'm sure there used to be a market here on a Saturday and you couldn't park here then. I wonder how long that's been gone. Unless I'm wrong, I can swear I saw a market years ago, weekends here. I suppose it's similar to Toxid just down the road where it's all but disappeared. Are you going to wear this? I might do, yes. <laughs> the dogs out for you then. Thank you. It's so funny every it's... time I see this particular hair to have to have a titter because my girlfriend in Louisiana has got Ooh. exactly the same hat. Oh wow! <laughs> Brilliant! <laughs> yeah, the product code on that one. Why isn't his grandma done? Is that what you had? Yeah. CM125? Yeah, it was. There's so many of them now. Card, please. Can I have a camping park? So this is Riding's Wood campsite near to Alfreton in Derbyshire. Quite a tidy site. Um, it's £19 for the night, so it is up there with some of the more expensive ones. It does include electric hookup. There is a cap on how much electric you can use. Um, it says that if you go over, then you have to buy more. We had an electric fanny to go in last night and we didn't run out, so I don't know what the limit is, but we seem to survive with it. <clears throat> Pitches are quite well spaced out, and they seem to be level. I mean, ours was. The rest of them look pretty much as though they're built up. This is one way round the site. There's lots of signs telling you not to do this and not to do that. You do get an A4 list of rules and regulations. Some of them highlighted in dark, 
font or there's underlines so if rules and regulations are not your thing then uh, you might want to give this one a miss but yeah pretty clean and tidy site there is a barrier with a code when you come in when I got here the office door was locked somebody came and opened it and there is a table across the front so you can't actually get in there to pick up any of the local leaflets and that they're probably concerned about this bug that's going around well we're back here at the storage yard we haven't done a lot of filming this weekend because we've been mainly visiting family so we hope you enjoyed the videos of the park ups and we'll see you on the next one which should be in about three weeks time at christmas shouldn't it yeah all right see you next time